I start with the fortune cookie opening? Hello, and welcome to another episode of Josh's Food Review. Today we have got our first entry from Panda Express. This is the bourbon barbecue uh, chicken blazing barbecue. <laughs> All right, this is the Blazin' Bourbon Barbecue Chicken. It's not barbecue. What? Why not? <laughs> okay, this is the uh, Blazin' Bourbon Chicken from Panda Express. Uh, it's a win collaborations with Hot Ones, you know, the uh, number one show on YouTube. But um, so interesting type of collaboration going on. We haven't had anything from Panda Express on the show yet. So, I'm just going to get this open real fast. I you know, pack this in pretty nice, so you can always appreciate that. So, we can get at least some of the first impressions on camera. So, it looks like we got some onions, some sesame seeds, peppers. It's supposed to be based on the last dab, so I'm a little slightly worried. So, we have uh, our special utensils, the chork. Got to love uh, Pan Express and their creativity. You can either use chopstick or if you so prefer, just the fork. And uh, of course, came with our lucky little fortune cookie. So let me just get this unwrapped. Only the best of preparations here on Josh's food review. So I'm going to use the. In, in interest of not making a mess, I'll use the fork side. So I'm just going to grab a piece of the chicken and give it a sniff and smell, smell, it. smell it. it. So it doesn't smell super hot, so like it's not immediately attacking my nostrils, which is, I guess, a good sign. So I'll go ahead and give it a taste. I've got a little bit of a crisp. Still waiting for the heat to kick in. Maybe I'll have to take another bite. If I can get some of the veggies with it, too. Get some of the peppers. Yeah, with the veggies in it, it definitely helps the flavor profile. Yeah, I'm not getting it. Even with the, the whole chili that I just ate with that. Very mild. And the chili just tastes kind of burned. The chili's kicking in a little bit now. I can kind of feel it in the back of my throat. But the chicken, like, as it is, like the glaze, like, this is just pretty standard. And it tastes a little spicy. Like, very mild. So I'm not really sure how they... And got inspired for the last step from this. So I was expecting a little bit more spice. Actually, I was expecting a lot more spice. So, I mean, it's good. It has good flavor, so... I mean, I like the taste, but it doesn't really do what it's supposed to do. So, I think for that, I'd probably give it a 3 out of 10, just because, like, it's still... I think for that one, I'd probably give it a 3 out of 5, just because, wow. like, even though the taste is good, I mean, I am rating it on what it's, you know, going out to do, when, you know, it's supposed to be super spicy, you know. The last step is the hottest hot sauce ever, like, Guinness World Record proven, so you would think something based off that would be a lot more spicy, but Josh, what's your heat like intake model date level? I mean usually like probably like a couple notches below like the hottest. So you like to call a media it's already like not No. Just just for the viewers out there who are like, oh, I'm gonna try it and like me, I put it to mild and I'm sweating. It's more sweet than spicy. If you eat a chili, the chili is kind of spicy. It's, just, it's more sweet. Like, this is very, very much. I'm going to eat it. It is good. It's just... I'm disappointed. She said it goes it goes good with Wingstop Ranch. And I was like, I guess it is just a bonus wing. He's like, yeah, pretty much. And I was like, wow. So, the flavor is good. It could be a little bit more crispy, but I think that's just a personal preference. I just... Really prefer the crispy chicken when it's glazed like that. So, um, decent. I give this, this uh, chork, though, a 5 out of 5. This is actually incredible utensil. So, crazy that I haven't seen one of these before. But uh, that's going to do it for this one. Uh, in the meantime, for the producer and myself, I'm Josh. You guys have a great rest of your night.